Welcome back to another episode of GTA LSBFO. Oof, hope you guys are enjoying the series. Today we'd be that patrolling as Highway Patrol. K9 unit. And we're doing a night patrol today. Usually I do patrols during the day, but I'm gonna do a night one if you guys haven't done one in a while. Um how many guys may know yesterday was actually the 13th, which Makes it three years the channel has been up and running. So, yeah. Thanks to all you guys who supported the channel from the beginning to where it is at now. Uh, let's get into patrol. Okay. Ooh. Damn. Anyway. Dispatch to Adam 5. To Adam 5. Show me 1041 10 8. Roger, 10 8. Let's put on a scanner for some traffic stops. And we got a flag. Stolen vehicle. Black. Okay. That's this one here. Traffic tonight, though. All units monitoring. We just received a complaint about a speeding vehicle. From what we can make out, the description matches a possible wanted suspect. Just clear another call. I'm in there. Jeez, what was going on with that white vehicle? Why did he stop in the middle of the way? Oh. Alright, so. A stolen vehicle. Possible stolen vehicle. Yeah, I don't know why they do that, but... Mm. Dude, what? Oh! 
do? What am I doing with that knife for? Really? Suspect neutralized. Roger that. Is backup required? Affirmative. Ten four, copy that. Backup required in Tatapia Mountain. Is medical aid required? Affirmative. No, I just realized the axe that separate. Usually they axe it together. Attention all units. Medical aid requested in Tatapia Mountain. Officers report an injured civilian. Dispatch units from um Albero Heights. An ambulance requested from uh Davis Hospital. Respond code three. SUV is responding code three. Okay, we got a uh... ambulance. Responding code three. I'm going to stop coming. Hmm. Let's let's mess the backup. These two officers I cannot learn from here. Why we wait for the ambulance? So. Uh, Shot the scene. I search the vehicle. She, she's definitely a stolen vehicle. She, as soon as we stopped her, she got out on. What the fuck? As soon as we, as we stopped her, she got out of the vehicle and attempted to stab an officer. So she's. I'm gonna be arrested for that. Okay, then. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with the ambulance up there. Spread. Okay then. I think they picked her up. Let me just see if I can press the charges. I still have her name and stuff in on the tab. Let me press the charges that I got before she leaves. Uh, Was the fan is possibly intoxicated. Alright, 
Is this an arrested violence? No, wrong thing. So why did I go quite on there? Be grown tough. Battery and assault of a uh, enforcement officer. Also, she's gonna get charge of possession of her when. Uh, also traffic can uh, actually possession with the intent of distribution of a schedule one because the weight was um separated I think that's all the charges she got and some charges after she goes to the hospital she would be charged This part took us into a truck. Tow truck. Assistance required in Tatavia Mountains. So I don't know what the hell is going on in the air right now. But... This much good for. Roger that. Code four. Right, that um, traffic stop turned out uh, very weird. A suspect was in possession of a stolen vehicle when we pulled over for a traffic stop. Uh, she de decided to attack with a knife and when we searched the vehicle she had I think it was 10 grams 10 one pound grams of um, heroin in the vehicle so she got charged with that on top of the assault of a police officer Yeah, looks like a good spot to settle in for another traffic stop. Robbery in Zancudo River. Let's respond to that. So it doesn't fly any other things. Yeah. Wait, where is this? The call not go true. Right. 
Gut wo? Ja, den gut schon. Ja, no, ey. Sharon's a black because hopefully should be this oops might not sign black I think it's yeah it's that one in front of this beacon here Problem over when we There you go, should this intersection up or not? No insurance. And my lights are on, dude. Desert. Right, let's see what we have here. It's no insurance, Get not expired. There's no insurance at all. Choose a give you. proof of insurance. Max again. Hello. Let's tell not why. Boom. So we ask why she's driving no insurance. She says she always drives carefully. She doesn't need it. So we're gonna probably give her a citation. Let's. License plate zero five zebra boy Charles three five zero. A traffic violation. Approach with caution. In the bed check on a license for an active orange. 
This time it has not much for your mom to know and trying to eat me here. Alright. Alright, there's no octave for runs. Well, that's it. Citations is for some she's been stopped. She have no history of any stuff. Uh, what we're gonna do? We're most likely gonna give her a citation and seize the vehicle. Go, because she can't drive it, it has no insurance. Wait a minute. Mm. Let's do a better life and drop uh, stop to make sure. Not under the influence of any, any drugs or alcohol. Thank you. When she comes comes back clean, she's just gonna get a citation. Thank you. There's be something suspicious that's going on. Uh, let's ask her to follow. Let me to the back of my vehicle. Up on the vehicle and uh, give us a search here. Yeah, she might have narcotics or need something in the vehicle. Ah! <laughs> Actually, we call it the canine. Can I know that there's something we go? That's detainer. Huh? She was just gonna get a citation. But since the canine alerted to something in the vehicle, she's gonna be detained. Without a canine, she would have probably easily gotten away. With just a citation. Hmm. 
Sandwich bag half full with colored pills. Possibly some sort of drugs, that's what the dog alluded to. So we're gonna check that in the some field test on that. Sandwich bag half full of pills. That's pretty suspicious. It's, uh, it's not that I see, it's not that I should see. But they for fat now. Mm hmm. Okay, so she's gonna get charged with possession of it. Oh. Needing backup. Let's get um. So she so not only friends, but she has a kind of a history. Based on the evidence we found, she has a notepad with the number of a known drug dealer and we found fentanyl in her vehicle. And about the fact that she's driving with no insurance. That's her charges. Possession of LBS Schedule 2 Fentanyl. That's the only felony charge she has so far, and everything else wouldn't really count. Make a citation for documents. Pay attention if you go. She's getting arrested for the drugs they found in the vehicle, and also uh, she would be getting a ticket for the driving without insurance.
Right. No transport. Dispatch, we got some prisoner transport. Requesting transport. Roger. Transport required. Wow. While they figure out what they're doing there. Let's go to a truck. Request into a truck. Tow truck. Assistance required in uh Grande Sonora Desert. Screw you. Alright guys, that would be... That would be it for tonight's patrol. Hope you guys enjoyed the series. Uh, let's just go over the charges and what was the result of the arrest and stuff we made today. So, the lady we arrested earlier on for... I think that was the first traffic stop with the stolen vehicle. Oof. For the first m misdemeanor charge of driving under the influence. First offense. Uh... Fine of three hundred and twenty-two dollars. License suspended for nine months. Three months in prison for the felony charge of possession with the intent of the distribution. The distribution. <laughs> I don't know why I can't pronounce that word. Uh, schedule one narcotic, which was the heroin. A fine of nine thousand dollars. Eleven years in prison for. Resistant arrest with violence because she did attempt to attack me. She got a fine of $249 granted probation for the felony charge of possession of heroin. Fine of $550. T four dollars three years four years in prison. Why am I reading that wrong? For the stolen vehicle and F fine of nine hundred and seventy nine dollars uh two years in prison the aggressive battery on a law enforcement officer fine of Seven hundred and thirty-three dollars, five years in prison, for a total of uh, charge fined of eleven thousand 
22 years and three months in prison. For the next person that we arrested tonight. I just arrested. The possession of... Well, she only had one felony charge. Possession of... But no, she got a fine of... $528, nine years in prison. She also got a citation for failure to insure a vehicle. Just a small fine of $194. And that's all the charges for today. Hope you guys enjoyed the series. If you guys want to see more LSPFR, which would be released every Saturdays, drop a like, hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to click on the bell to get notified when I release the videos every Saturdays on the channel. Also, if you guys want to check out my live streams, I stream every Mondays, Wednesdays, Fridays and Saturdays, 7pm EST on my Twitch account, link down in the description. I'll see you guys in the next one. Which is out. Peace.